I guess he just lives around here or something, dude. It's wild. Look at this big boy. This is nuts. Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Community Controllers. Community Controllers is a show where you, the viewer, send me controllers and I attempt to make them work in a video game. Rainbow Six C. Here we are! Look at that! To whoever somehow got my home address and sent me a Jacksepticeye hoodie, please don't do that. Today we have a large selection of controllers we need to get through, so go ahead and get you a cup of coffee and get settled in. It's about 11.15 p.m. Our water grew some sort of algae since we left it alone in the sun. Last time it seems as though a lot of you were triggered, we didn't use the drill. <laughs> we're gonna jump right into it right off the bat today with the the Wii Fit Board. Yeah, we fit board. But before we get started with that, we need to mention our sponsor for the video. How are you so well groomed for a homeless man? Well, it's funny you ask, because the answer is Dollar Shave Club. This video is proudly sponsored by Dollar Shave Club. Dollar Shave Club has a lot more than just shaving products. They now have shower, oral care, deodorants, and even butt wipes whenever you're done dumping on other players and FPS games. Right now you can get their shave, shower, or oral starter set, each for only five bucks. It ships straight to your door. I tried these three starter sets and I can genuinely say I'll be buying more from them because it's so quality. My favorite was the oral care starter set. I was supposed to like wait and put it in the video, but I just started using a toothbrush because it looks so quality. Go to dollarshaveclub.com forward slash basically homeless to get your first set, your first starter set for just $5. Thank you so much Dollar Shave Club for supporting my channel. Whoever sent the Wii Fit board, uh, thank you very much. I can tell it was it was used with some some really musty feet right here, and you didn't make any effort to clean it. So I appreciate that. It smells very unpleasant, and you can you can see you can see how great it looks there. So like I said, we're just gonna we're gonna plug this bad boy in, and we're gonna make it work. <sighs> The Wii Balance Board took about an hour of the night to get working. All you really need to know is that I had to use the Wayback Machine in order to find the software to run this on a PC. It was not a pleasant experience searching for this software, but it paid off in the end. RIP, dude. Oh, <laughs> yes, dude. <laughs> okay, it only took two hours of my life, but here we are. This was one of the harder ones to set up, but definitely one of the easiest to use once it was working. Now we just need some input to shoot, so let's go get something to shoot, yeah? That was hype. We officially have Waz the input from the Wii Balance board. So I think the next step to bring us some input with our hands on this is going to be this here, uh, this here tap wireless key. Uh, wearable keyboard and mouse. Mm -hmm. That's pretty neat is what it is. This here is fancy. This is fancy. This will be my, my aiming and my keyboard input. It's 12, 17 a.m. This one seemed like it'd be very simple because it's Bluetooth and intended to work for Windows. So they say, first it really needed to be charged. Tap keyboard has to charge, so I thought it was a perfect opportunity to talk about this. Some really, really decent fan decided it would be cool to send a, uh, a 2008 track phone. It has no input of any kind other than the power. No Wi-Fi and no Bluetooth. So... I know there hasn't been much gameplay up at this point, but I can assure you that the gameplay at the end of the video will make up for all of it. I eventually got the tap keyboard working with the <laughs> dumbest solution I've ever had to use on the show, but I'll show you that in a second. 
because after about an additional 30 minutes of troubleshooting the tap, I got triggered. Well, the tap is garbage. It's a fat piece of garbage. And sidetracked. What? Okay, it's 1 a.m. We troubleshot a long time, a lot longer than we thought. Here's what we're gonna do. Here we go. Little guitar here, wee guitar hero. Little wee guitar hero, yeah. For the Wii Guitar Hero controller, I just used a Glove Pie script, which is a lot simpler than it looks, and can be done by you, if you wanted to, with a few Google searches. And then finally, I figured out what the problem was. With the freaking tap controller, dude, it was just that it wasn't close enough to the Bluetooth thing, dude. The dongle. It was all about the dongle. It needed to be closer to the dongle. Nothing. But then, as they move it closer, oh, oh. And so I had a very easy solution. I friggin' taped Maybe the Bluetooth the dongle to my arm, and then it was close enough. Oh, yeah, here we go. Oh, that's doable, dude. We're freaking doing it. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Literal bots. Literal bots just pushing me. That was 100% a fake reaction to the Guitar Hero controller. Uh, it's 5, 5 a.m. I think the sun's starting to come up. The reason I didn't go into ranked with that is because I think there's one thing left that's just gonna be better. This box right here has been sitting over here. It's a VR headset. This one doesn't have any display in it. Well, it just so happens I have a four inch HDMI This display. is when it really began. I was basically Tony Stark in a gamer cave, creating the most immersive gamer experience from many, many different peripherals. Prepare your eyes. What a coincidence that we have a perfect fitting display. For the most immersive, mustiest, demented gaming experience in all of gamer history. My homemade VR Wii Balance Board wearable keyboard and mouse gamer setup. Immersion. I am going to transcend now into a different dimension, or so it will seem to me. I am fully immersed, and that's how I shoot. Uh oh. Okay. Did we get him? All right. We didn't get him. I was so immersed there for a second that it felt like I was actually about to die. I was terrified for my life. Um, now that we have all of this working, it's time to go into a ranked match. Because the screen was so low resolution, I couldn't read chat, but I'm pretty sure someone on the enemy team said Mr. Hummus, meaning they recognized me. And then they did the unthinkable. They banned Ash. They, they banned Ash. Nope. 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 Not playing. And that's the end of the video. Psych. Mr. Hamlet, we're gonna be an Ash and Yeager. It's gonna be a bad time for you. Playing ranked with complete immersion. I'll kill this drone. I got it. <laughs> Let's go exploring, everybody. We can't use any ladders. Oh, no. On the left. Oh no. Regardless of how immersive it was, as you can imagine, it was very difficult. I died over and over. Bro, I didn't even get a chance to shoot. Then the enemy team started talking trash. Easy elo, I think. And there wasn't exactly any quality conversation going on. Oink. Oink. Then I almost got a kill. Oh my, if I had an LMG there, it's freaking game, dude. <laughs> but also just died again. So at least I killed a drone, right? And then it was over. Psych again, kids. Psych again. Yes! Yes! Oh, you killed him! Yes! 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 <laughs> Yes! I just, I just, I just!
I aced with the with the. I am so immersed. I am so immersed with my hand. With my I hand. became an epic gamer. We had an epic Wii Balance Board gamer moment. Frags on frags. I was insane. And the conversation picked up nicely as well. <laughs> Let's go! Let's freaking go, dude! I'm insane! I'm top frag easy, 13 and 3. Hey, homie, why are you end up playing in a five stack with yourself? I got tired of me, bro. I got real angry at me. Didn't want to play with him, you know what I'm saying? Literally, I am unstoppable with the Wii Balance Board, and nobody can beat me. I actually just want to take a second, though, to thank everyone in the game for being a good sport. I know it's really fun to watch people get triggered at me infringing on their silver elo in a ranked match for using something dumb. But it's nice once in a while for everyone just to kind of be chill about everything. And everyone was super nice. And a quick shout out to these guys for, uh, for letting me shoot them. Let's freaking go. Love you. Love you. 18 and 4. 18 and 4. 18 and 4, you can't get any better than that. You can't. You didn't get any better than 18. What a wild ride we've been on today. Thank you all for watching. Join us next time on the Gone Fishing edition of Community Controllers. Gone Fishing. We could have used this, this tortured phone as like a mouse.